Welcome back to Nerds R Us, where anyone can be a kid. I'm joined by my sexy co-host, Tyler Foss and hey. Max Siemens. What up, what up? So today we're going to be talking about Deadpool 2. You know him, you love him. This movie was fucking awesome. Dude, it was fucking awesome. It was so good. Ah, dude, Deadpool, they're, like, they're almost not superhero movies. They're all, like, superhero spoofs. Yeah. yeah. Like That's sick. Like, every action scene, I'm like, this is, like, a complete joke. They're just making a joke out of it. <laughs> like, it's not, there's not one part that's serious. Even when people die, it's like, yeah, it's pretty funny. Right, when he's, like, taking the guns, he's, like, taking the hands out of the guns of criminals and just, like, Cutting chopping their everybody's hands, hands off. off. <laughs> Catching them on the sword. <laughs> like, a fun man <laughs> stabs that dude in the head. Oh man, my favorite part was with uh with Colossus yeah. <laughs> fighting dirty with Juggernaut. <laughs> Sticks the fucking electrical cord up his ass. His ass <laughs> I just pole. about fucking died. <laughs> I was like, get the fuck out, dude. Dude, I love how the Asian chick that was like dating ultra mega sonic teenager was like such a fucking Asian stereotype. Oh, Yoko? Yeah, yeah, yeah dude. Just Yoko. Pink ass hair. Like, like, Yoko? She's like, Yoko Ono like, reference? <laughs> I was like, get the fuck I was like, the minute she throws up a peace sign, this movie's racist as fuck, too. Yeah. <laughs> I was surprised she didn't do, like, the double like, The double peace sign with, like, sign. the awkward smile. Yeah. Final. yeah. <laughs> fuck. Yeah, no, that was funny as shit, though. Ultra Negasonic Teenage Warhead or some shit. <laughs> <laughs> and then, <laughs> dude, the, the fat, uh, the fat little, uh, uh, New Zealander kid yeah, yeah, <laughs> calls her Justin point. Bieber. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking, t- dude, <laughs> Deadpool's like, see, see? <laughs> I fucking died, dude. I was, I was crying laughing at that yeah, point. I was like, this is fucking funny. ridiculous. Oh, uh, he's like, you guys are a couple? And she's like, yeah, we're girlfriends. He's like, I'm not hating. I'm just surprised anybody would date you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, what do you think about the story? Okay, so what do you think about Cable? Um, He fucked some shit up, dude. He was badass. Yeah, so I was, I was, I mean, I was tracking with it, you know, pretty well the whole time. I was like, it, you know. I thought it's, he was it a makes kid. Sense. I wish he was a little bit bigger. That was yeah. the only thing. I yeah. was like, he needs to bulk up. Yeah. And, I mean, it was Josh Brolin, right? Yeah, it's Josh Brolin. Yeah. And, uh... Which every time I see him, I'm like, dude, get the fuck out of here. Go back to Goonies. <laughs> dude, it's weird as hell. Like, he is... He's, like, made a fucking major comeback. Dude, since Men in Black, what, 3? Or whatever yeah, it yeah. was that he was in? Dude, he's like... Which definitely wasn't even that good. It That's sucked funny. ass! <laughs> and it was like, he, he flipped the script with that yeah. shit. Like, he came back strong as fuck. I know, and he's like, oh, by the way, I'm in every superhero movie. Like, yeah. <laughs> dude, fuck, he's been in, like, yeah. everything now. Well, he's in every fucking Marvel movie because of post credit Thanos scenes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right. God, dude. Super not mad about that shit. He's crushing it, but... Um, I was, I was tracking, um, up until the, uh, him turning back time to yeah. save Deadpool. I was like, that kind of came out of nowhere. Well, first off, I was like, well, I mean, he does, but in the comic books, he does come back to the present, not to like stop the world from getting destroyed or anything like that. I think he comes back to like stop Sentinels, if I'm not mistaken yeah, or something like that. But yeah, I was like, oh shit. Yeah, the Sentinels were the Although next. it was dope when he turned back the time though, and then he like slapped him on the chest, and I was like, oh, he's like, he's pit. I thought he like pit something right there, but then it was the coin yeah. from yeah. his wife, and he's like, real lead. Yeah, you like, saw him, you oh, saw him pull it out of his bag or whatever, and then slap him on the chest, and then tuck his fingers, and I was like, haha. <laughs> but no, I mean, Cable in the comics, I don't feel like he was like, squishy like that <laughs> like i feel like you would have just cut the collar off and been like sorry bitch <laughs> like, and your regeneration powers suck a dick <laughs> like i don't think he would have wasted his you know his last fucking trip to to save deadpool realistically in the comics like unless he was like a necessity for the future cable's just not he's not like that soft of a guy <laughs> and so i was like that that was a little bit far stretched for me, but I was like, but I feel like cinematically, I mean, not a ton of people are going to be like, oh, fucking Cable's my jam, you know? <laughs> like, well, people aren't yeah, going I into mean, that, in like... reality, like, 
non-hardcore X-Men fans don't know him. Yeah, they don't even know who Cable is. Character. Yeah. They don't know that he's the freaking son of Jean Grey and Scott Summers. Yeah. They don't know about his eye. They don't know the situation with his robotic arm. They yeah. They don't know the situation with the Sentinels and him being, like, the leader of the X-Force. Also, did you notice, though, that when Deadpool's, like, suit got hit by the ash... It turned it into his X Force suit, which mm. is black and gray. Yeah, yeah. I was like, I want to see what tight. you fucking did there. Yeah. I was yeah. like, oh, you fucking yeah. Okay. The the Loki references. Yeah, oh, I was I like, respect. that's fucking tight, dude. Because like when I saw that, I was like, I was like, oh, you know, his mask is gray or whatever, which is kind of like a like a little Easter egg throw in thing. But <clears throat> then it zoomed out, and it was like his whole fucking suit, yeah. minus like the inseam of his leg. Yeah. Like it was like pretty much front and back, minus the inseams of his leg. And I was like, "Oh motherfucker!" <laughs> like, yeah, hey, talk about fuck. that dude, freaking surprise cameo. Brad Pitt just popping up in Deadpool out of nowhere. Yeah, Brad Pitt. Dude, Brad Pitt was the invisible man who hits the fucking electricity. Dude, no for, like, shit. Split second. Where he like hits the electricity and it shows who he is. It's Brad Pitt, and then you never see him again. Really, dude? Okay, so like I looked at his face first, like, cause like I didn't I didn't assume that we were gonna see him. So I looked at his face for like a split second, and I was like, God, that face looked familiar. And then I just didn't think yeah, about I it. Just again. Leave over, I just leaned over my lady. And I was like, What's that, Brad Pitt? <laughs> 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 oh fuck, dude, just such a fucker. It was so, I was like. No fucking way! Like, dude, my favorite was when he jumped back through time. <laughs> when he's, go when he's home! St- <laughs> yeah, he's like, You're go not home. Not a part of this. There is no X Force. <laughs> 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 Just tells him to fuck off, and then uh, um, shoots himself in the head for the script <laughs> of Green Lantern. I was fucking dying. <laughs> You're welcome, Canada. <laughs> I was like, shit. And then he kills shoots himself in X Men Origins. Yeah, Wolverine. just trying to save the can- save the franchise. <laughs> it's okay, don't attack me. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that was good times. I God. like when he was like fucking around with uh, Professor X's like headgear. He's like, oh, it smells like Patrick Stewart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my God. That was like, fucking I awesome. I know what you're about to say because this machine tells me what you're gonna say. And he's like, that's not how it works. He's like, that's not how it works. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just fucking copies it the whole time. Oh, uh, just taking Cerebro for a spin. <laughs> yeah, he's like, why can't we get more X Men? Where's like the pigeon guy? And then uh, and his hands, hands over, over, and they're just like slide the door. Slide, shut. Yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck. I like his Logan like little figurine at the beginning too. Oh, dude, that <laughs> killed me. That rotating. killed me. I was like, and you gotta think like. That had to have been made for that movie. Just for like, that movie. There's no way that was CG. That looked real as fuck. Yeah. I was like, no, no, them. that was that was real. <laughs> Dude, they have to have a cast for that. I want it. <laughs> like, I'd so buy the bad. fuck so out of that. So what did you think about Stan Lee not actually being in the movie, but just being <clears throat> on the brick wall in the movie? That was kind of different. I was kind of like, it kind of made me sad a little bit because I was like, oh, I know. It's coming. Know, it's it's going to happen soon. Eventually, man. Because they Eventually. had to film, because they filmed all his cameos for, like, three movies in, like, the span of two days. Yeah. Just to, like, make sure he was in of all of them. Yeah. Yep. I loved how they were like, we're going to assemble a team. And then everyone in the team died. Yeah. Straight out of the gate. <laughs> yeah. They were like, let's go. And they were like, you know, there's like a, like a wind warning. They're like, who knew there was a wind warning? Like, everybody knew. <laughs> I was like, oh, dope, Terry Crews is in this movie. I love Terry right. Crews. <sighs> Windshield, dead. Dude, I was, I knew, I knew at least Terry Crews was going to die because I was like, no, I didn't see him in any of the trailers. No, he's not dude, a big just enough part. Just in one scene yeah. of the trailer. I was like, he's not a big enough part to really, like, you know, make anything happen, I bet. And then... When, he, when they were all parachuting down or whatever, Deadpool gets hung up on the sign, and I was like, yeah, he's a trained mercenary. Like, he would at least, like, you know, have some experience with that, you know? So yeah. I was like, yeah, that makes sense. And uh, <laughs> everybody else is kind of just totally fucking green, <laughs> green thumb in it. Oh, man, man. Oh, no shit. So we just got some breaking news that apparently the... Uh, 
the redneck that cable one of the redneck that cable electrocutes is Matt Damon. I didn't even oh, fucking shit. know I that. Didn't catch that. I didn't catch that at all. There's so much shit going on in those movies that you yeah, have to watch yeah. them three or four times three before four you times catch everything. everything. God, that's fucking wild. Nah, that's that's dope as fuck though. But yeah, I I knew like most of the X Force was gonna die. I was like, so you pretty much have Domino and Deadpool. Yeah. And then that's exactly what ended up happening. And I was like, all right. Well, like, well, I was like, oh, they're bringing a bunch of B listers in this movie. That's like unheard of. Like Star Shatter and Camden and fucking like the kid with the acid spit. Like those are yeah. all like super B list X Men. And still, I was like, oh, that's cool to bring it in this movie. And I was like, oh, never mind. Just kidding. They were totally being dicks about it. Yeah. Right. Dude. He's like, my power is that I'm better than you at everything. And he's like, one of these days, I'm going to find a planet of people who are worse than me than everything. (laughs) Just a planet of Nimrods who can't focus on anything and take care of themselves. And I'll be their (laughs) god. (laughs) (laughs) I love how he kept referencing himself as god in that whole fucking movie that killed me. I was like, yeah. (laughs) That's fucking awesome. You just call himself god? Yeah. I think he just did. Yeah, I think he did. We're not X-Men. We're X-Force. We're progressive. We're gender neutral. <laughs> <laughs> and at the end, where they're like, "No, we'll get the kids." We're X Men. He's like, "You're X people." X people, <laughs> dude. And then uh, when Domino was talking on the plane or whatever, and he's like, "Peter, shut the fuck up, <laughs> nerd." I don't remember asking for your opinion. And he's like, "That wasn't oh, me." That wasn't me. <laughs> <laughs> I, was like, <laughs> I was fucking dying. I was like, "Yeah, yeah, that's good." <laughs> Dude, I love uh, Rapinder. Oh, God, dude. (laughs) When he killed that fucking dude (laughs) in the end, I was not expecting that at all. I was thinking something falling down out of the sky. I was like, oh, maybe like uh, Brad Pitt's body, like, just fucking like gets shit mixed. Like the parachute gets caught up in the air again or whatever and just like comes over and like slaps him <laughs> kills him or some shit I don't know I was like something stupid is gonna fucking happen yeah and then Dopender was like Ram! Yeah. <laughs> just fucking crushes him I was like alrighty then that's not the way I saw that going at like, all we need a simple team and he's like my need for blood runs with a fiery hot rage and he's like does your need to fucking refill the towel dispensary but, like burn with a fire hot rage <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry you had to see that <laughs> but I'm glad you saw it <laughs> Dude, I love that guy. He's so oh my good. god! He's such a good side character, dude. Like, I'm not telling you every anything. Actually, I have a really low threshold for pain, so I'll tell you everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! And then him describing Deadpool every time. <laughs> He's like an avocado. He's like an avocado. <laughs> And then describing the baby legs. <laughs> <laughs> what does he say? You're just like. Cockshirting it. Yeah, cockshirting it. <laughs> oh, nope, nope. He's just sending it with a cock shirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I almost Fucking didn't catch the gag uh, credit intro for a second. And they're like directed by the guy who's like killed John Wick's dog. And oh, then yeah. oh, fucking cinematography god. by Blind Al. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that shit had me cracking up. Dude, every time. Every they time did it like they a fucking. They shit. did it totally Bond style. Yeah. Yeah. But it dude. was like all him. Yeah. Just and in have the chair some, with those shells raining on him. Yeah. Thing. Have the depressing ass <laughs> like opening credits and then yeah. like, and then have James Bond spoof right afterwards. <laughs> I was like, yep, this makes sense. <laughs> like, that was pretty fucked up, and I'm laughing already. <laughs> <laughs> what about the after credit scene? Scenes plural. Which all of them, the ones where they go back in time and all of them are super good. I was about to say, back in time and back saves everybody. Time. So I looked it up, I was like, is this canon? Looked it up, totally canon. No shit. Yeah, which means like his wife didn't die and like none of the other people in the X-Force died. He like went back and saved everybody. Well, here's, here's the thing is like what I thought they were getting at with that is um, I thought they were getting at the, uh, the whole... Um, premise that he doesn't he like isn't he in love with death well in like the comic books death is like in love with him and then like Thanos is in love with death and so like he can't die which is like why there's that situation yeah 
And so they kind of played <clears> off that though <throat> with his wife where he was like going back and he couldn't die and he couldn't like touch her and shit. That's kind of what I thought they were referencing. They were referencing like, it like is, hardcore. Is she the like is the physical death? entity of death? Like is she, is that what her role was so that she could like be with Wade, like what? What's mm-hmm. the deal there? And you know, that's why I thought they were referencing. But if he goes back and saves her, and that's canon, then I don't know. I'm, I don't know, man. I'm like, fuck. Are they gonna Are they gonna bring that out in one of these movies to where, you know, that's a that's a fucking main plot line or some shit? Because if they do, it'll be like super <clears throat> snoopy. But they're gonna oh, give yeah. her like a dollar store like Halloween Grim Reaper mask and shit. Oh, it's just going like to be, a, like, frilly a bra- black lace and shit. Plastic, you know? like, <laughs> fucking scythe with, like, the little liquid blood that moves in it when you move the scythe back and forth. Right. <laughs> Dude, I don't even... Do they even have that shit anymore? Like, they had that when we were kids, but they I think that's like Halloween too town violent. And stuff. And yeah, they still have that stuff, but, like... It's a lot harder to come by. Like, I'm you don't sure. buy that as a kid anymore. No. No, like, they, they don't have like, at the dollar store anymore, do you think that? They have, like, 18-plus <laughs> rating on shit now for costumes. It's like... Jeez how do you have to have that on there like okay you're 12 don't be a slutty nurse yeah, yeah like no. that's fucking problem solved like slap Hello, your kids around Hello a bit more. like a magical time of year like where no matter what you are you're the slutty version of that yeah true you're like army man Slutty army man. Well, see, here's nurse, the thing. Slutty nurse. Top yeah. gun. Sexy top gun. Sexy, sexy top, top gun. gun. Wait, it's the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> Beach party? Yes. <laughs> ZZ top? ZZ top off. <laughs> right. <laughs> ZZ topless. <laughs> oh, fuck. No. I don't know. It used, like, growing up, for me, like, you know, when you saw slutty outfits, you're like, oh, older chicks. Neat. Now? Dude. No, no, no you know, I don't go out because it's like, dude, I'm getting hit on by fucking 12 year olds and shit. And it's like, I don't fucking know the difference. They look like they're <laughs> supposed to be like 20 something. Yeah. I'm like, nope. Like, how, <laughs> close, how close ball. is the like nearest school zone? And <laughs> my judgment where, where am I in relation to like, yeah. <laughs> dude, fucking speaking of age restriction, they fucking checked my ID before I went into Deadpool yesterday. To Get watch the it. fuck yeah. out. That's weird. I know. I'm like going in. They're like IDs, and I was like, "Really, bitch? R- really, <laughs> like, dude? I'm almost thirty. <laughs> like, just oh, bitch. <laughs> oh, bitch. God, they made us go get him out of the car. God damn. They weren't letting us in. I was like, that's, that's such a fucking shit. Utah thing. I know. If that happened yeah. to anybody in another state, please send your angry hate mail to us. And we will make <laughs> we a like video of story. us jerking off onto it. <laughs> Because that's some bullshit. Soggy yeah. notifications. First of all, in the movie, it says Soggy. it's a family movie. They specifically yeah, say they it's about family. It's a family movie, yeah. I mean, it's family-oriented They built fuck. the whole family, tries <laughs> to have a baby. It's like as family as it gets. Exactly. Everybody's kids should see that movie. Yeah. I mean, if you have crying infants to, you know, four-year-olds... They're more than welcome. Take your kid to Deadpool and don't bring him to Incredibles too. There exactly, you go. <laughs> exactly. Fuck off out of my goddamn Incredibles. Feel free to you know have them join in the laugh and horror of of Deadpool. <clears throat> what do you think? What do you think about Juggernaut? Uh, it's an interesting side character. It was. I didn't think it was going to be Juggernaut. I yeah, it was not the character that I was expecting. So I was like, I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I fucking love Juggernaut. Juggernaut's I love him and the kid are walking up to the orphanage, and he's like, so you have to wear that helmet to keep your brother from reading your thoughts? And he's like, yeah, but he's in a wheelchair, so it evens itself out. It's <laughs> <laughs> like, holy fucking damn. Right. Yeah. Dude, there's so much savagery all throughout that movie, just slowly intertwining to make it greatness. Oh, yeah. It was fucking great. Jabs everywhere on it. Dude, savage as fuck. But... Yeah, I don't know. Like, I mean, they at least, as <laughs> like Deadpool said, <laughs> epic CGI fight ahead, dude. I was like, <laughs> I was like dude, true fucking story, man. Two of my favorite characters from Marvel, you know, by far, by far, are Juggernaut and Colossus. I was like, they're like, they're fucking like the top beast. Games, like powerhouses. That's yeah. why, dude, I just, I always loved them. I was like, God, they are fucking tanks. And that is... 
She's something I'm in love with. I'm like, yep, I'm cool with this. I'm cool with this. Dude, but Col- did you guys notice Colossus' tooth got knocked yeah, out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was fucking pissed at myself. I just about died. I was like, then he shouts, that's how we do it in Mother Russia. <laughs> I, was, I was fucking out. Dude, I was like, leaned over in my chair, dry heaving from laughing at that shit. I was like, this is fucking stupid. <laughs> like, I can't believe that. Yeah, good, good ass times, good ass times. Man, the whole movie all around. What did you give it on a scale like one to ten? Ten like best movie ever, one like worst movie ever. Dude, I'd at least give it like an eight point five to a nine. Like eight point five to a nine. It's like yeah, even it's the first the first one was the same for me. Yeah. You know. Yeah. It's just fucking. It, it was very well done. They got so much nuance in those movies. It's fucking insane. Like, <laughs> the uh, the sheer amount of time. They have to have, like, 40 different fucking people throwing little Easter eggs and references yeah. and disses in. Like, they... <laughs> there's just so much in those fucking movies, man. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah. It's so a 8.5 to, like, 9. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably a pretty accurate score. They were scored, like, an 86 on Rotten Tomatoes. Oh, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Not bad. And the Han Solo movie on the score is like a 71. <laughs> really? Yeah. Well, it's, I feel it's going to be more like Rogue One, where it was kind of, you know, slow build up, um, a lot of character development, and. Well, I could tell you right now. <laughs> Extraction. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> he said hashtag spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> oh, fuck. But yeah, so I could see that happening. You know, it's not one of the main film. Yeah, it you know, it's a side movie. It's a it's a money making adventure for him. Yeah, and it's just like Rogue One. You know, it's like, do we need to know that story? No, no, we don't fucking need to know that story. That's really pointless. I mean, it's got some interest because yeah, the Star Wars. Yeah, that's why. you know, it, that's it's, why any Star Wars movie that comes out, no matter how bad it looks, I'm like, ah, fuck, it's gonna stop. But I'm gonna have it does to have some it. good story plot to it. I mean. You get to see him how he meets Chewbacca. Yeah, you get see, to see that's him how kinda, he gets the Millennium Falcon. That's like, kind of where I feel like it's going to be more interesting in than Rogue One. And Rogue One, I felt, was a really good movie. Yeah. Like, all in all, like, the total story development and character development. That I they thought it was best because pursued. they all died at the end. That was what I liked. <laughs> that was what I liked about it. I was like, there's no need for these characters to live past this story. Yeah. Kill them all. Yeah. yeah. Cool they story. Did, they did a really good job at closing it out. So it wasn't necessity to, like, try to intertwine them back in and stuff. And, yeah. I mean, CGI was fucking tits on that movie, too, by the way. Like, fuck. So if, that, if it's... Or Rogue One? <clears throat> Rogue One and, well, Deadpool, too. But, um, <laughs> but yeah, so I feel like they're going to, you know, have some good shit in, in the solo movie as well. But we shall see. It was tits. <laughs> I guys want to think we've uh, come to the end of the show, so... Definitely feel free to download this and share it with your friends at nerdsrs.com. And also check out our Facebook, NerdsRS, that's N-R-D-S-R-U-S. And you can also find us on Twitter at NerdsRS1. Send us those fan letters we were talking about, or your hate mail as well. Send nudes. We survive off your hate. <laughs> just, just send nudes. It doesn't have to be your nudes. Just Any nudes. Just nudes. I mean, big black cock, whatever. I mean, whatever's entertaining. Just throw us your Pornhub, you know, history. <laughs> <laughs> or your channel. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, well, guys, thanks so much for listening and really appreciate it. And stay classy, stay beautiful, stay nerdy.